Looks like I might have to stay up for a little bit longer since, well, Bleach isn't out yet, in which I hear this chap that Bleach chapter is a big WTF. But anyways, ways now on to the One Piece review, and we see Caribou, Caribou, what he's up to, he woke up and had a shitty old lady next to him. And no, unless for some reason you didn't see the page, page, and no, he wasn't in bed with the old lady. This chapter basically picks up where the last one left off, where Luffy just punches Caesar like a boss. Like a boss! I need to get sound effects. But yeah. Basically, Caesar's like, Bastard, do you know what I... What? Oh, I need to get a good voice. Hmm, what's a good voice for this moment? Bastard, you know what... What Dumb Flamingo's going to do to you? He, he spouts some nonsense pretty much. He's the trigger of evil. He is the winner of all the big. Oh, oh, now I have the voice. I have one. He's the winner of all the big. He's the most evil man alive. And I just go with entirely racist. I apologize. But yeah. And basically, what happens is care is <laughs> Cap really just an attack it absorbs it and Luffy just freaking egg it it looks well I mean not caribou Caesar basically just Luffy eats it straight whole then we see what where everyone else is at and then we see Usopp in the Sam Ryan Brook basically looking for a son he see he knows as a dragon he's in tears and then we go to the highlight of the chapter now this is where opinions are going to be very split on this chapter. Some people want... I can see why... I would have preferred... Fergal to be def defeated by Smoker. But... But... I could see why Law... Uh, Law did... Well, they're both... I do... I'm actually not sure why... Why... Oh, the Law should have defeated... Fergal. Everyone's thinking, oh, Smoker is going to kick Fergal's ass for what he did to his crew and be a goddamn traitor to the Marines. They fight head to head, head, but Smoker gets his ass whipped to him. Law ends up getting his heart, heart back. He puts on his hat. Puts, and then basically here's what happens. He says Fergo is done for. You're going to lose your little your basically there's basically oh yeah I should have this I'm really just for some reason I'm getting uh, stopping. Basically the the snail phones, I forget what they're called, rings. I believe it's Don Flamigo on the other line. Basically says Fergal's done for, you're gonna lose, well no, but Law says you're gonna lose your most value to boring it. He says, says, that you couldn't foresee this worst possible outcome. And he basically says, aren't you piss, pissing on Fergal, who's right in front of you, do you remember what happened in the past? Do you remember what happened in the past a couple times when Ferg go when you really pissed off Fergal and Fergal looks like he did a bunch of steroids in five seconds making him into the incredible Fergal Fergal smash but yeah I Basically, Law pulls out his sword and cuts Fergal in half. He says, it's been two years since the war. Exactly who put one in motion? The only one who kept the peace. Peace. Wipe your put into the last era. The Marines have been preparing a new battle force. They haven't challenged the big names yet. 
But yeah, the Marines are pretty much says he's prepared, they're preparing for the war, for that war that White Beard pretty much said was gonna happen when One Piece is found. But my now here's my thoughts on the chapter overall. This was a good chapter. I could see why opinions would differ on this chapter. I thought Law was a badass in this chapter. He did great. He, the fight was short as hell, but the but basically cutting the incredible Fulger in half was all, was pre was a badass moment. But Smoker should have defeated Fergal. I can see why people even say this chapter was a bit trollish, and I'm not gonna lie, I'm a bit of One Piece, or maybe that's why I like this chapter. But yeah, I can see why opinions will be very split on this chapter. But yeah, overall, I thought this was a solid chapter. But yeah, anyways, I'm Amy Game Nerd signing out. Peace.